My name is Jim Wayne. And uh, you said you've been elected as a, you've been an elected representative? Yes, I was uh, in the Kentucky House of Representatives for 14 terms, so that's 28 years. And so why, why is it important for social workers to uh, become elected officials or be on, uh, in the legislative arena? It's absolutely essential that our voice be present in these legislative bodies because the legislative bodies typically are dominated by people who do not have the people skills that we have and certainly do not have the conscience and awareness of really helping people by social policy. And that's what we bring to the table when we're in the legislative body. That legislative body could be a school board, it could be a township trustee situation, a county commissioner, a city council, state legislature, or Congress. But it's essential that we have presence in all of these deliberative bodies. And so I really encourage uh, the social workers to think about what your gifts are and what you have to offer your constituents in, in shaping social policy in the uh, place where you live. That's so important because the dominant culture is gonna move in the opposite uh, direction to what we as social workers hold as value. So you're saying our voices matter? Absolutely our voices matter. It's a counter force and we protect the most vulnerable people in our society. No one else can do this as well as social workers. We understand the vulnerable people. We understand the social policies that will help them heal and bring them up. But we can't just sit back and try to talk about that and debate it. We need to get into the arena. And that means being in the legislative bodies to actually shape the social policy that will lift up our clients. And so what would you say to someone who don't believe that our voices matter? Well, I would say you better, <laughs> you better wake up because the social work values and the social work beliefs do matter in shaping social policy. But it can't happen unless you're there speaking up for our most vulnerable citizens.